Welcome to Kinky Knots Cafe, Proactive is the Way, where we provide you tools and resources to enhance your mind, body, and spirit. Get ready, folks. Let us nurture you from the inside out. The world is your oyster. Your future is as bright as your determination. Hello, my friends. Wow, there are so many amazing things going on, and I am equally excited that each one of you are here to join me on this journey of building our way forward by creating the life of our lives in which we all dreamed. This month, we are revisiting a topic in which we shared during season one in episode two of the Designing Your Life series. Please make sure you check it out. I just rewatched it and I am so amazed at our growth over a year and a half within the podcast, personally and professionally. During this time, we really took time to to get to know ourselves inside out and garner tools and resources to help us overcome negative behaviors and design systems that would help in our wayfinding and ultimate success. We created our five-year odyssey plans, and I thought it would be great to check in with you to see how you all are thriving within your plans. Really, I want to know. So please contact me and send an update to support at kinkynotscafe.com. If you recall, back then I had developed two plans. One, which focused on my business and the other on my children. I learned so much and accomplished more than I ever imagined working on these two plants. What did I learn? (laughs) My plans, they need to be bigger. I not only successfully accomplished what I set out to do, I went above and beyond. It was As if the universe said, girl, uh, stop playing small. I have included a link to my plans in the description for you to check them out. And I want you to compare them to my year in review. At the end of each year, I always do a year in review. It is so helpful. And doing so, it helps me to assess my year and determine if I am on track. I have also included links to my year in reviews for you to check out and see for yourself how I played myself too small and accomplished way more than I ever imagined. So why am I venturing back to the design your life phase? Well, as a designer, a creator of your life, it is so important to revisit your designs and look for areas of improvement and continued opportunities for growth. And based on the last two years, I believe I am ready to build out my third Odyssey plan. I never designed it because I really didn't know if I was ready. But after annihilating my first two designs, I know that I am beyond ready and look forward to seeing how this one plays out. If I can be candid, we are only supposed to choose one out of the three, and I managed to successfully accomplish two out of three, but one in which I never designed. So prior to commencing this plan, I have decided that it is time to do a little bit of prototyping. Do you recall what we learned? Prototyping in a designer's world is all about asking good questions, outing our hidden biases and assumptions, 
iterating rapidly, and creating momentum for a path we'd like to try out, embarking upon a physical experience in the real world to get data. As the authors share, prototypes help you visualize alternatives in a very experiential way. That allows you to imagine your future as if you are already living it. Creating new experiences through prototyping will give you an opportunity to understand what a new career path might feel like. It helps you to involve others early and helps build a community of folks who are interested in your journey and your life design. Prototypes are a great way to start a conversation, and more often than not, one thing typically leads to another. Prototypes frequently turn into unexpected opportunities, and they allow you to try and fail rapidly without over-investing in a path before you have any data. Prototyping is also about building empathy and understanding. Our prototyping process inevitably requires collaboration and working with others. You see, everyone is on a journey. And your prototype encounters with others will reveal their life designs and give you ideas for your own life. (laughs) Where have you heard some of these terms before? Biases and assumptions, empathy. Yes. In our last series about having the courage to be vulnerable. Are you witnessing a pattern here? How each series is building upon one another? I'm all about helping you set your foundation. So, right now, I am in the process of finalizing my third Odyssey plan. Once I get it finalized, I will drop it in the share drive with the others so that you can have a sneak peek as to what I have in store over the next few years. This new plan requires networking and engaging in a space in which I am relatively green. It will require me to brainstorm with a community of people within my industry and get their perspective on my plan and the viability thereof. During this time, I know that I will need to be open-minded and receptive to constructive criticism. I am also a borderline introvert, so I'm going to need to come on up out of my shell and let go of my hermitage. Guess what? I am ready. Brené the sister up and showed me the way forward and Dahlia a system to help me in making damn good decisions. So I feel well prepared. Are you with me? If not and you want to join me, catch up, dig in, and let's get her done. I'll end on this. Most people fail, not for lack of talent, but for lack of imagination. It's time to imagine greatness, y'all. That's a wrap. Join me in two weeks when Tiffany and I get to learn about the life experiences of our guests, their life designs, their various ventures in life, and how they had to prototype and experiment to find success. We look forward to you joining us, and in preparation for our discussions, please make sure to review Chapter 6 in the Design Your Life book by David Evans and Bill Burnett, and check out the article within Psychology Today, Experimenting Your Life by Robert Tyvey. All the details are in the description. To access all replays or learn more about Kinky Knots Cafe's Proactive is the Way, please visit www.kinkyknotscafe.com. Proactive is the way, my friends. Take good care.